At the moment I have too many seedlings that still need a little bit of protection, but I'm running out of space in my cold frame. So I've bought this mini polytunnel, which is very easy to set up and pack away when I'm finished using it. This polytunnel is a great solution if you don't have the budget or space for a greenhouse. And if you have many seedlings that are not ready to be planted outside, or if you want to grow lettuce outside from autumn to spring. It is a cheap solution and only cost 15 euros. When you're finished using it, you simply pack it up and store it for next year. It is very easy to set up. The poles are numbered so you can't go wrong. using pegs to make sure that the tunnel can't blow away with heavy wind. These are not included. The plastic cover is quite thick and has a zipper opening for easy access. Time to move my seedlings into the polytunnel. In goes the rocket. These are my Mitsunas. These are the forget-me-nots that I sowed in autumn. My white and my red onions can be planted outside as soon as my raised beds are finished. There you have it, an easy low budget solution for those that don't have a greenhouse or space for a cold frame. You might remember that my vegetable garden was full of raspberries. I've saved some of the plants and I'm going to plant them against this fence. I dug a trench and now I'm spacing them out. Much closer than preferred, but I have a tiny space so I hope they won't mind. Planting is easy, dig a hole and pop them in. If you plant them too deep, they won't mind at all. These are autumn fruiting raspberries and produce fruits on this year's growth. So you can cut them down to the ground in winter or beginning of spring. I give them a good soak after they're planted and hopefully they give me lots of berries this year. Over here I have my forget-me-nots that I still haven't had the chance to plant out into the garden. Uh, my white and red onions, uh, the turnip salad leaves uh, and the rocket. 
As soon as my lettuce seedlings are big enough, I will plant them straight into the soil, into the polytunnel. The soil will already be warmed up a little bit and it gives them protection from the rain and the wind. So let's keep, let's keep this warm and protected. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you ever so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. See you next time.